Oh, let's see if we can arrange that. Come on, zombies. Everybody pile up. That's looking pretty decent. Alright, so fire. Fireball. Ignore. Can't quite get them all. That's all but the last one right there. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. That's 14 targets in the blast zone. Well, let's see what happens. That's three hits. <laughs> One, two, three hits. Yeah, not quite efficient. <laughs> uninjured, 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 lightly injured, heavily injured, uninjured, moderately, moderately, uninjured, uninjured, lightly uninjured. So, so there you go. <laughs> Some of those guys got damage coming out those broken windows. So yeah, it's not just what's being reported here. I thought at first maybe it was just the uh, the log not part not reporting correctly, but uh, it's definitely not. So next, let's try uh, flame. Let's try to line these guys up. All right, let's uh, burning hands. So there's I can get five out of these six. Let's get the grappler in the mix. So that's five in the target zone. So one, two, three, I see four, but it said zombie hit times two there, so I think that is five. So I assume the same, no, I, I, well, okay, I think maybe I do understand this line now. So if the same type was hit for the exact same damage, we get this multiplier number. But because this took different damage, it had to report on a separate line. So two, three, four, five. So that actually hit everybody. So we'll do it again. Burning hands. Let's see what grappler zombie is going to annoy me. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to get everybody lined up a little better here. Alright, let's try this. Burning hands. It's four right there. That was kind of weird. I want the uh, I want the shrieker to go away so I don't get dazed. I think I'm gonna single target the shrieker. Uh, so 75 mana for 36 versus 50 mana for nine. Pretty sure this is the better choice. All right. Who else we got damaged? Quite a few of them damaged. I get them in a nice tight group like that. We're down to 2177 mana already. Still haven't eliminated this little tiny group. That's my concern, is that... Well, I guess if the fireball gets fixed, the ratios will change a bit. But even then, it would take three, four of the fireballs, so it's still going to take a third of my mana pool to try to drop these kinds of low-level zombies. hard time kind of getting these guys lined up the way I want them.
Oh, failed. Knocked on my ass. Sixteen hundred mana. So we burned through more than half my mana. Uh, I think it's easier just to point flare the rest of these guys. Oops. Got to turn off that thing again. Thought I already had it off. All right, they're all dead. <laughs> Uh, I gotta get used to the magic still, but that still seemed like an awful lot of mana just to kill some low-level zombies. And yes, I'm still fairly low. These are all cast at level 5, I think I got them all to. I might be on 4 on one of them. What the hell? Oh, I see. Had it targeted wrong. Uh, I'm not going to pulp all these. Block, minor ammo, minor tools, goofy clothes that I don't care about. Yep, don't care about any of that stuff. Alright, what vehicle am I seeing? Standard car. Hey there, library. Point me to the magic book section. Mm, nope. Looks like glass blowing is the only one we're going to get that's useful. Anything in the other room? Nope. Alright, no love for us. So, there's the pile of drinks. No V8s, lots of everything else. Let's go check the front room, see if we've got medieval gear. Ah, what am I hoping for? Fitted chainmail and mace? Broadsword? Broadsword! No fitted chainmail, though. Everything else fits. <laughs> Is the broadsword a replica? Uh, no, it's not a replica. Well, we'll take it then. So, let's wear the scabbard. <laughs> Take the broad sword. Oh, good old great helm. Because everybody wants 30 encumbrance on their eyes and mouth. That's a great idea. You should all wear great helms. Especially with your ornamental plate armor. <laughs> with 35 encumbrance on the other locations. Yeah. It's especially important to make sure that everybody wears their Great Helm and their Plate Armor with their Strength 8 character. That way you've got 45 pounds of gear tied up in your two pieces of armor. <laughs> so you've got uh, almost half of your carry weight tied up in just those two pieces. Alright, anything else? I want some more options. I'm happy to see the... Uh... The broadsword, but I want my fitted chainmail, damn it. No fitted chainmail for me over here. Alright, let's go to the broadsword for a second. <laughs> and we instantly get hit. As I try to fight on my rollerblades. Miss, miss, knock down. <laughs> yeah. Laptop. I haven't found one yet. I guess I'll grab it just in case we do run across. Act Pro. Oh yeah, dining room, don't care. Not sure. Not sure why. Bedroom I don't care much. Whoops. Keep being mean to me. Another Kevlar vest. 
I should probably take that just so I don't have to go source Kevlar elsewhere. <laughs> so this is not, I repeat, not optimum broadsword gear setup. <laughs> You do not want to be... Oh, my duster's almost gone. Yeah, this is not optimal. So, <laughs> I'm going to be missing a lot and getting hit a lot because I'm rolling around with 47 torso, 21 on my arms, on rollerblades, getting knocked down constantly. So. I've got healing spells and I know when I need to pull back, so I'm not overly concerned about the damage I'm taking currently. But, uh... Don't do what I'm doing if you're trying to stay alive, is I guess what I'm saying. Why am I not? Oh, I left it back at the thing. I should have brought my night vision. Bedroom. Alright, come get me. Whoops. Wow, was that a bad move. Alright, stop hitting me in the arm. Disinfect. I didn't mean to move into the bathtub. Trying to do that with rollerblades was absolutely stupid. Terrible move. Cost me way huge amount of movement points, so I got hit a bunch of times. Knocked down, hit a few more times. <laughs> so that was a that was a pretty terrible maneuver. Oh yeah. Uh, eh, I'm not actually going to search through these bedrooms. Nothing back here. Uh, I'm not going to go bother looking for the first aid kit. Sometimes there's a first aid kit in the pool area, but I've got enough of them. Whoops. <laughs> so bad. Oh. Mm, such a terrible plan. Alright, this is the dining hall area. Or the, uh, the ballroom, I mean. Hey, ballroom. Yeah, nothing I care about here. Let's pop upstairs. Nothing in... Oh, he followed me up, you little bastard. Forgot I had Z-levels turned off still so they can follow me. So many misses. Bub liners? My gloves, leather gloves. We'll take the leather gloves. Uh, don't care about that room. Cop zombie I want to kill. No Kevlar that time. Alright. Now it's getting a little out of hand. Jeez. I'm just getting all of my clothes shredded off me by these guys. <laughs> all these incidental hits. Um, pain is also starting to be a factor. Yeah, this one guy has hit me. I, I'm losing track. Alright, we might die right here to this one guy. Have to get the magic out. <laughs> yeah, a pain spell would be pretty good. <laughs> I don't even have any of the better pain meds. Not a single one yet, which is kind of funny. But yeah, like I said, don't do this when you're playing. This is all really, really bad. Oh yeah. Do, 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 do. Disinfect. Torso. And let's put that away. Whoops. Let's uh, put that away to... God dang it. Come on, put that away the correct method. And cure light wounds. Cure light wounds. Come on, cure those light wounds. 
Alright, now we have almost no mana, but we're almost back to full. So far, net loss has been a bunch of clothes I don't really care about. I'm probably naked on some body parts at this point. So I got the jacket. That's about it. Got the helmet still. Eh, head's actually in pretty good shape. Um, torso and arms are getting pretty thin, though. Hands are getting thin. Legs are getting thin. Yeah, pretty much everything's getting thin. We'll throw the gloves on. And the thing back out again. Alright. Um... Nothing useful down those hallways. No, nothing you care about in there. I don't need ammonia. Uh oh. Alright, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna bag the search through the uh, mansion here. Fruit leathers, fruit leathers, three of the nuts that I like, and I don't care about the rest. This is the trophy room. No trophies, not a single one, huh? Whoops. Alright. Come on now. Now we're getting a little uh getting a little rambunctious with three of you on me. Low strength and dex. Not sure. Alright. Put that thing away. Jeez. Uh, phase door? Run mode? Alright. Yeah, it's getting a little out of hand now. <laughs> now we're getting to the point where it's getting a little dangerous. Hey there, Shrieker. Let's just go out the front and rollerblade our way out of here. Anything in the mailbox? No, and... Is that a limousine? Yep, got another limousine over there. We'll have to go check that out as well. A little bit of gas, we can get some more. Gas, don't care. Another bottle jack. Make him go away now. <laughs> 21 mana. Alright, we have fully burned through entire thing of mana. Not gonna pulp any of that. No, not another zombie. Leave me alone, zombie. Um, nah, we'll just let him come behind me. I'll, oops, I'll just walk past him and go get in my car. All right, you all heard me though, right? Do as I say, not as I do. <laughs> That was not good planning or fighting. <clears throat> Just in case any of you thought that was how I normally handle things. Uh oh, they got something on the... Um... Recharger, what you got on there? Couple batteries we'll take. How are you looking? No charge on the ga on the battery. No controls. Alright, so we'll leave it alone again. I care what's in the refrigerator. I don't think I care. We'll let that dog 
Let's mash into it. I'm kind of surprised I didn't see any ants. So I thought we would see some ants up this way, but um, apparently we're just far enough. So let's roll up the road. We'll uh, raid the vending machines here in the railroad, and then we'll probably stay here for the day. We will uh, do some healing, get some gear sorted, do some spell reading, and uh, get moving again in the morning. All right, where are you? See? It is going down. It's just super long-lasting now. With the light amp goggles, I have yet to see decrement yet. Alright, Kevlar. Batteries, batteries, batteries. Laptop. Read that book. Keeping all of this. I uh, actually don't need the fire axe if I've got the bronze sword now. All right, I got a lot of stuff that got tore up, though. I'm down to my rucksack, about to fall off my body. So I'm not going to have carry capacity if that gets hit again. <laughs> Means I'm going to have to switch to a duffel bag or clean something up. I don't think I have much in the way of filthy gear. Yeah, just the uh, Kevlar. So I'm going to have to keep an eye out for a rucksack I can clean up. Um... Yeah, my cargo pants are about to go too, so. Bit of an issue. <clears throat> Especially since I can't really afford to raise my uh, tailoring skill too much. V8! Yay, V8. And I guess I'll take. Ah, they broke them. Bad zombies. Nope. There we go. Oh, look at this one. Look at this one. Two, two, five, two. All your shelled nuts belong to me. And I'll take some pretzels and the fruit leathers, too. Alright. Yeah, I guess we're thirsty. Let's take some... Yeah, it's all frozen. I'll take none of it. All right, that should be it, I believe. Two more? Yeah, two more. I think I missed these last time. Uh, purple. All right, that's it for sure. Whoops. Crack and hunting ore. Blank body. All right, where's the flaming eye? <laughs> where's the flaming eye? Ruger... Full crowbar. Nothing. Meth. Can't quite see the other one from here. Lots of meth. So, full crowbar is about the only thing over there that would even mildly interest me. I'm just going to stay away from that area. What I don't have back here in this area is a uh, nice convenient bed or chair that I can sleep in. I don't want to try to sleep on an aisle. Hmm, I don't think about that. I don't know if there's any sleeping spots in the, uh, the railroad, like a sofa or something. Chairs and benches are the only things I know about. is I don't think so so looking like maybe this well I can't close that window yeah there's 
not really a good sleeping spot in this place. Um... Guess we could get moving again. Yeah, I'm really unhappy about the uh, ant farm or ant hill lab proximity. I'm not even going to go into that lab. There's a motel here. Might have a map that I can use, but I've already got road maps for a fair amount of this area, so it's not really critical. Um, I think at this point I'm looking for another big, big building so I can get a big, large radius identified. So let's, um, I think we will roll out. We'll head over this way, follow the road. See what we see around Seekonk and uh, Lincoln Hampton area. Hey, oop, how did I get mana? Oh, hey, it, it got rid of the ones I can't afford. Cool. Good interface. Um, let's actually get our food and water caught up. All right, uh, dump it all. All right, old slate pain will. Go down over time. We're generating mana slowly. Vehicle's in good shape. Battery's fine. Gas is fine. We haven't done any major ramming or anything, so... Just remind me if you see a convenient vehicle with uh, side mirrors to rip those damn things off. Keep forgetting. Limousines ain't got no side mirrors. All right, now we're heading into ant territory. Let's go below the hill. And work our way around. Yeah. Ouch. <laughs> All right, you things. Too many damn ants. So, that's how many ants are this far away from that ant, that lab laboratory. Ain't no way I'm going in that thing. Just stay away from laboratories that are that close to ant hills. You will die. Not from the ants directly, but from the walls that are removed and collapses and such, opening up lines of sight. Trailer park doesn't get me any height. So, some houses and a trailer park. And then the... Uh, Motel, I think. Get a little closer, and then I'm going to circle around to the south. Alright. Standard car, standard car. Ambulance with stuff in the back. That could be important. Let's go find out. Nah, there's absolutely nothing at a hotel I care about. So, solid line of forest to the south. Can't do anything about that. Looks like it's just coming down to, do I want to roller blade down and check that ambulance? In my current condition. Amp sites. I don't think I will. I'm going to run into plenty of ambulances. We've already got the stethoscope. Really all I need left from the ambulances is... Pain meds would be nice, and uh, scalpel. Oh, that's an LMOE shelter. That might be the new LMOE. I haven't checked out the new one yet. Uh, we got ants over here too. Whoops, and we got forest blocking me in on this side as well. 
That's not good. There's no way that if I'm seeing ants that they're from that. So there must be another ant hill somewhere in the area. Where are you at, giant ant? Excuse me. <laughs> you don't get it. Oh, all right. I do get it. Yeah. So there's uh, there must be another ant hill somewhere over this direction. I don't want to leave my vehicle anywhere that zombies are going to show up. Stop driving. Take off. Throw the birds. Oh, hi, giant ant that's actually in my vehicle again. I really, really hate this hitchhiker process they've got going on right now. It is really goddamn irritating. Well, there goes my rucksack, and all my crap just hit the ground. <laughs> uh, get out of my goddamn vehicle, Ant. That is so annoying. Ugh. Um, I don't remember if I've got any spare backpacks in the back either. I may not. A whole bunch of my stuff just hit the ground when the rucksack went down. About 10 liters of random things. Uh, yeah. Really, really damn irritated. Probably going to chew off my cargo pants too if I try to kill him. Well, let's take, give it a try. <laughs> Naturally. <laughs> One stab and he goes down. Ah, uh, Ant, you have made me unhappy, though. Let's first check. <sighs> Apparently, I, did I pick up a whole bunch of hitch hitchhikers when I was driving through Antland? And are these broken? Is that how they got in? Because of the color differential? No, still says they're in place. I just... I have one backpack. Alright, throw the backpack on. That'll at least get me... Give me the basics. So I've got the corpse there. If I move to here and say... There to there... That puts the corpse in that. Oops, got zombies out that way. It's open to butcher the corpses real quick. I might get to it. First, let's make sure I... Jeez. Get my gear. Some of it fell into the driver's door position. That's right, gotta get rid of that anyway. Titan sinew, chunk of fat, chunk of meat. Can't quite grab all the meat. <laughs> I definitely need to take time to make a uh, Stop running. I need to take the time to make a uh, duffel bag at this point. Probably should have done that earlier. I didn't know I was going to go all suicidal in a mansion, though. Alright, let's head on up here before we do anything else. It's going to be the new design. Um, it's kind of dark in here. <laughs> uh... 
Activate. Helmet. Wear. Goggles. <laughs> Take off. Goggles. Well, uh, activate. Helmet. Yeah, totally black in the head with the helmet activated, and that's pretty funny. <laughs> All right, good times. You got water in these? Nope. Both empty standing tanks, but that's that's eight 60 liter tanks if you take those apart, which would be really easy. Oh, look at all the tools. All right, I call bullshit. This is too many items. <laughs> it's already too many items. I'm on a 50% item drop rate. <laughs> Wood saw, screwdriver set, hammer, pliers. Only thing you're missing, eh, it'd be better to have a wrench, but the only thing you'd be missing would be the uh, the hacksaw. Old kitchen setup. Got a water pump for fresh water, steak knife. What else we got? Multiple backpacks. Oh yeah. Oh rucksacks. <laughs> oh damn it. Somebody commented on uh on Discord that it was gonna be another place I'd have to put on my do not go list, and yep, <laughs> they're right. It is looking that way. Did I actually pick that earlier stuff up or did I shuffle it into the wrong position? Don't need, don't need, don't need, don't need. And grab anything there. All right. What else we got up here? Mess kit, another awesome starting item. Duct tape. There's a pot and a wood stove. So you got all the cooking gear. Bunch of books, unfortunately not anything helpful. Nice bed. Is that a dead end in that corner over there? Apparently it is. This is the bathroom, right? Yep. All right. So this is not the design that I saw actually. So I think there's more than one new design for the LMOE shelters. This is not the one that I remember seeing a picture of. <clears throat> All right, so. But yeah, 50% drop rate for the kinds of drops we just got in here. That um, seems a bit rich. Just so you know, right there, item spawn scaling factor, 0.5. <laughs> I agree. I like the design. I just think the item scaling is a little high. Um, Alright, so do we camp here? I'm a little close. I'm worried about my vehicle a bit. I'm not sure the game world is actually obeying my, uh, my Z-Levels off command. After what happened at that apartment tower. Um, I'm 1 p.m. Not seeing anything I care about here in the town so far. We're going to end up having to go around it up this way. I hope there's not forest blocking me, but we know for sure we've got an access to that road. So there's a facility right here of some kind. And there, and there. I want to get up there and see what these are, and then we'll make a decision. But I think I'm going to keep moving for now. Yeah, it's a pretty nice starting spot if you pick the... I forget which of the starts give you the LMOE shelter. It's been quite a while since I did whichever one it is. Alright, get that butchered. I think I'll just toss that one right into the exterior storage. Um, I 
Yeah, let's, let's do this spell again. Alright. Pretty nice place. Both that design and the one I saw on Discord were pretty cool. So... Oops. Hey there, pile of stuff. Fruit leathers, granola. But I'd have to get out and go pick them up. Eh, I guess there's not really much else in the area. Except for a uh, skeletal brute. Eh, I think I'm doing fine. Ignore all. Alright, come on. Get the right zoom level and speed here. <laughs> not like we're hurting for food. Oh, another fire truck. There's my wing mirrors. They're ripping off the wing mirrors. Bad zombies. Still want the halogen bar, but I'm not going to stop to check for that. Alright, where are we? So, northern section... I think there might be a separate city right here, actually. And I suspect these are not endpoints. I think this is all city. Might be a second one, or it could just be Hampton, I guess. But, I need to go north through here. Clay deposit! One of these days, I shall use a piece of clay. <laughs> Hasn't happened yet, but... I, I, at some point, will, I'm sure, desperately need a piece of clay. Uh, oh, crap. Is this Necropolis? Oh, this is a Necropolis. Irradiated Wanderers! <laughs> I ran across the Necropolis, finally. It's been forever since I've seen the Necropolis. Hey, everybody. Welcome to the Necropolis. <laughs> I knew it was as soon as I saw that. As soon as I saw the design here. And then I stopped and I checked here and saw the irradiated wanderers. So yeah, it's been forever since we came across the Necropolis in one of my challenge series. I was getting a little worried that my, my normal map settings might be weeding it out. But um, nope, it's just rare. Necropolis. Um... Not the best place for general gear and stuff. It's got its own uses, if you're not familiar with the Necropolis. It's an endgame location. But it's not really good for just general looting. <laughs> so, that's not ideal. Let's just uh, zip our way through here, hopefully without getting blasted by anything. Um, I'm not even going to stop to look for gas, I don't think. We're doing fine on gas. Uh, is, that the, is that the light tank or the atomic? That's the light tank. You got tracks? You do not have treads. Alright, not going to worry about you, Mr. Light Tank. A lot of gas there, but I don't want to deal with it. Uh oh. Another fire truck. Can't see any tools on the one side. I really need to get my uh my wing mirrors fixed. <laughs> There's wing mirrors right there. Alright, can I see the far side? Nope, can't see it from here. Can I get close enough? Alright, it's got no stuff. That's all I care about. All right, so Acropolis and a radio tower. So that's unfortunate. Uh, I like this though. Evac shelter set off. Oh, an apartment tower. Evac shelter, apartment tower right up the road. That's perfect. That's going to fill in this huge area here. We get to the top of that tower. So I want to find out what's here at the end of this point. I'm going to drive down this way just a little bit, fill in a little bit of this area, and then we will uh, we'll backtrack to here, find out what's... I guess it's got to be at this spot. Might be a trailhead. That'll suck. Oh, there we go. That's what I need. I need a semi off by itself. That'll give me... 
gas and the wing mirrors if I can get to it cleanly. Right there. Let's go to the controls. Ah, diesel. I forgot semis are diesel. Uh, nothing in the cab there. Nothing in the carry spots. Back. All right, they're moving a little too fast for me. Yoach. All right, I was hoping to get the wing mirrors, but I don't want to deal with those guys right now. It's not that big a priority. Or wing mirrors. All right, that fills in that whole section there. I'm not seeing anything I care about. Ice cream shop, duplex. Yeah, absolutely no reason for me to dive into that area. Whoa, slow down. There we go. Got us back up to near full. Mm, no, I shouldn't need that. Uh, it's an electrical, st electrical station. Large power substation. So, shock zombies and technicians. If I had magic, technicians would be easy to drop. I'm not doing any CBMs this run of any kind. So, I don't have a particular need to go after technicians. Although, they do drop tools. And the workshop here will have some tools. There's one technician already in sight. Actually, I think these ones only have techs. They don't have shock stops. Let's go ahead and stop here. Uh, what am I wearing? I am wearing my... My nothing. I'm running around with bare feet. I'm running around with bare feet. Alright, let's try not to get zapped. I've got nothing in my hands for them to grab. What you got for me? Nah, nothing good. Some copper wire, which is coming in schools of 800 for some reason nowadays. And I think I saw a total of two technicians up here. Um, eh, three. Hmm. Four. <laughs> Number keeps climbing. I think four is it. One, two, three, four. Easy kills for the most part, but um, I got clothes that are about to fall off. Be a little problematic. I'm wearing backpack, backpack, rucksack. <laughs> Let's not try that right now. Come on, climb that fence. Alright, let's dump the rucksack. That gets me down to 15 out of 26. Uh, not terrible, but not great. Need to carry that around. <laughs> All right, we're going to add leather pants to our mix here. Now well, let's go ahead and go get them. They're going to be stealing my weapon constantly, so it's either melee or magic. I don't have 
I don't have a lot of either. Hmm, with four of them, I don't know that I could keep enough weapons on me. <laughs> I have to go in there and go in there with a boatload of weapons. Yeah, I grabbed the uh, the backpacks and the rucksack from the LMOE shelter, as you just saw, as I dumped them in the inventory. Um, best thing to do actually would be to have them come through the fence after me, but uh, it's gonna take them forever to break through the fence. And I would just run them over. Hey, zombies. Sure would be nice if you would just break through the fence. But no. Yeah, if I had a full bar of mana, I would just, uh, I'd go ahead and nuke them, but... There's a chance they've got some pretty good tools. Um... They added a disclaimer for bugs in the experimental build? Where? Where does this disclaimer appear? <laughs> it built into the game itself? Is it... I, I guess I don't understand. Oh, message of the day? Who reads that? <laughs> I didn't notice it. Uh... All right, let's let's try. These these guys aren't really all that dangerous. Let's grab a few extra of something. What have I got? I've got a steak knife I could stab with. I've got a crowbar I could bash with. I've got the sword, which will go. We'll, we'll draw that last after they take my other stuff. Uh, I'm sure they can grab an aluminum bat. But let's go ahead and take that. And a uh, fire axe. I think that'll give me enough. Alright, let's wield first a hammer. <laughs> let's see how long it takes the hammer to disappear. Oh, oh, they can't... I don't think they can zap me through the fence, actually. I don't think their, their, tele, their telekinesis works through the fence. Just like shock zombies can't shock you through the fence. So, I could shoot him to death. Yeah, screw this. Let's just go shoot him to death. <laughs> Why worry about all this other stuff? Let's do it with, yeah, the trusty M4. Alright, let's drop Fire Axe. Backpack. Keep the hammer. This is where the M4 disappears from my hands. Hey, buddy. Fire. 100% with a precise. Sure. Come here, you. Get up here. Find your buddies. All right. Well, that was a whole lot easier. Cordless drill. Really? All that for a cordless drill. And a tool belt. Well, we'll take the tool belt, take the ID card, take the solder. I think that gives me all of the solder and everything else I might need. Uh, I don't care about a mining helmet. Don't care about the corpses. Yeah, that was that was a lot less than I thought we might get. Don't need any of the rest of that for any other reason. All right. Reload. Oops, I don't have any more. No more 223 Remington? Hmm. I guess that is true. I haven't really been picking up all that much ammo. I need 223 and 308 for the current books that, or current weapons that I've got. Alright. Uh let's keep this up front. Drop it in the seat right there. And I've still got the bat. Alright, bat goes over there as well. Okay, I think we're just going to go due east, scope out whatever's over here, and then we'll curl back up north, I think. 
Come back over this way and we'll check out the evac and that apartment tower. Uh, uh, there were no vehicles out here, right? No vehicles. Oh, great. I use up some of my bullets and then we find the helicopter. Um, run these guys over. Blow some more rounds and hope that I get a weapon out of them. Or just sit still and wish that I had mana. Hey, buddies. Little in the vehicle with me, and he's going to get to stay. He's not going to get ejected while I drive. God damn, I hate that crap. There goes the pants. <laughs> I hate this so much. So much! Can't explain just how much it annoys me that zombies get to do this stuff now. This one wasn't as egregious as some, but it's still bad. It's still really, really bad. <laughs> uh, really, really annoying. And he brings me a radio. Alright, you. One, two, three, four more. 21 shots. Um, It's going to be close. I might empty the clip on these guys. That's too close. Alright, hopefully I got a gun out of it. Or some ammo. Yeah, we got an MBR rifle. That at least returns most of the ammo. Two, two, three! Ballistic glasses. Alright, we'll... That's the only gun out of the whole group. <laughs> uh, well, it wasn't a total loss. We got a few odds and ends. Adderall's no longer any good. At least not for what I used to use it for. They changed the drugs to no longer make you more intelligent, so you can't just slam Adderall and cigarettes to raise your intelligence when you're doing your CBM installs. Alright, let's dump that rifle since we've almost emptied it. Um, throw back on the rucksack. Back, back. Don't need infrared. Take that. Take that for other reasons. I'll take the battery out of that. Useless. Eh, that's all I care about. Some of these odds and ends I'm picking up are because I know I'm going to need them for things I'm going to create later. If you're curious why I'm picking up filthy leg ammo pouches and tool belts and ballistic glasses and such, that would be why. Uh, leave that. Let's drop the backpacks in there and the gun over here. 